Hi, I'm C.C. Cummins and Raw Goddess Baja here in the States. Um, the, the actual Raw Goddess Green Smoothies is closed for the summer. And uh, right now I'm just kind of, uh, I'm going to be a little bit showy here with my body so that it's the um, second day of my 10-day transformation cleanse. So I am really excited. Actually, what I'm showing you is not so much my body, but just the chopping up the vegetables. But I will, with that said, remove everything but the bathing suit top because I have gained some weight in Mexico. And um, I'm just going to try to be relaxed. Yeah, I've gained, I gained some weight in Mexico. So um, I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, it's a little bit, little bit. Here's the whip. Just kind of relaxed, and then the back also has gotten heavier. In fact, that's where, well, yeah, kind of the heaviest is along here right now. And anyway, this is a before because I'm doing the transformation. It's more, you guys, you know what people don't get? It's not so much the size of your body, but it's the quality of your tissue and of your body. If, the, if you're eating, what you eat and goes in this mouth, it goes directly into the tissues of your body. And right now, mine are not as high quality. If you're eating organic foods, plant foods, vegetables, you're hydrating, you are, um, what am I trying to say, putting in food that does not have, it does not have artificial colors, artificial flavors, it's not made out of animal products or laden with hormones, pesticides, insecticides. GMOs, genetically modified, um, not, you know, so it's not going to be with fluoridated water. So you're eating food that's green, vibrant colors, red, yellow. It's going to make your skin creamier and smoother, and it's not going to have ripples and all these little whatever pimples and that kind of crap in it. That's the thing. You can be skinny as can be. Have you ever seen a really skinny person? But they're they got huge circles under their eyes. They're all pimply. Uh, their, their skin looks sallow. It doesn't matter how young they are. They just look old. Well, that's because they're not getting high quality food. So first thing you do is same thing the crazy sexy diet Chris Carr says is what you don't put in. You make a checklist, and that's on your your fridge. No white sugar. No white flour. Um, no dairy. No meat. You go down the line, and of course I stop at coffee. <laughs> <laughs> that is going to be affecting my skin tone, and I know that. I knew it when I was even in my 20s. When I would stop the coffee, the pores would become more refined. So, but what I was taught, though, by actually Dr. Meltzer, who did study with Av, uh, Pablo Orola, he has an office in Del Mar, Dr. Meltzer, Barnett Meltzer, and I have gone down there and taken some of you know Wolf and Arrow. The horrible, horrible people. Yes, well, Wolf and Errol. And I went in with him and them and Fawn to Dr. Meltzer for Wolf's health, and I eventually ended up going back to him by myself in my 20s because I was having some issues. And he said to me, he goes, okay, quit everything else. You know, quit the bad, the bad, those bad, bad things. But have your coffee in the morning. And in fact, at that time, I actually smoked cigarettes. And that doctor said, you know what, have your morning coffee. Have your morning cigarette, just do the juice, fruit, and almonds. Don't skip it. That's your breakfast. So, And the bee pollen, and I started getting um, other things. So anyway, I just wanted to say, this is it. This is front and back. I'm starting on my 10-day. This is my second full day, my 10-day transformation cleanse, which I desperately need. And I'm having it in a lovely place in Oceanside area, Carlsbad area, with lovely people and we're doing a lot of family healing and closeness and it's so important to really be patient. Don't make rash decisions or choices of, you know, shutting doors on people and especially loved ones. Whatever's in the way, get it out of the way because I've, I've dipped my toe in those waters and I, it's an offense I really don't want to cross over. I, I feel that you know, if it can be healed, do so, because our, our lives are precious, and our families are really precious. And um, anyway, so I just was bringing up about family. I am doing 
this, I feel that the quality of my the tissue, the quality of your muscle is going to reflect what you've been eating. And I have not been eating a good, what, a good ideal um, raw vegan, living vegan, or even just like a totally clean food, even if it was only high raw vegan, even if it only was high vegan. You know, it's still, I can't say that, I think the culprits really for me, this is going to shock people, but it's not like any of a confessional video, but it's just, some of you won't be shocked, but most, a lot of people do this every day, so I was shocked. But the wheat tortillas, harina in Mexico, they're very rich with a fish taco or a cerveza, a beer. The beer is probably full of high corn fructose, um, high fructose corn syrup. And then probably that tortilla is made, hopefully not, but hopefully it's made of Crisco, but it's probably made with animal fat. So hello there, <laughs> get out to reality land. And so I was doing too many of those over, you know, just having really when you're in, if you make a choice like I did to move there and live there, and then I also chose to be in a household that that's where the main staple was, so, and I didn't have a lot of the spending money, so I was eating what people were eating. Anyway, um, I do take full responsibility for that, though. I did do that. I was the one who did it. I was the one who chose it, um, and I still am in that situation. I, I actually still have my, you know, I... I live, I live with somebody that does eat very differently than I do, and now I'm on the road and traveling. So I have an opportunity to step away from that, and I have to take responsibility. So everybody that's watching this, like, what I want to say, my dilemma is, because I'm getting a lot of people are calling me and writing me and messaging me, and they're asking me, Cece, what are you going to do with Raw Goddess? Cece, what, what is up with the shop? Cece. How long are you going to be in California? CC, when are you going to Oregon? CC, when will you be here? Blah, 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 blah. So I'm really happy to hear all these things. It's just that how can I really know that? I mean, all I have right now, I have to live my life by intuition, and I want to have the kind of freedom where I can do that. And I think that it does require teamwork, though, for us and in community to really gain momentum off of each other and rising up to the next level. As an individual, you know you're going to affect your other friend and the people around you. And so it's sort of the opposite <laughs> thing. Of, so if you, <clears throat> never mind, I'm not going to go there. So all I'm saying is it's, it's all coming into place when it's supposed to. And I'm grateful because I'm right where I'm at right now and I'm able to do phone work, start my, get my people on each of my legs for the skincare mask, get those two people. I don't have my two people that want to do that as a business, and I can't understand why, because that's total insanity as far as I'm concerned. But, oh, it smells good. So I'm working on an email, though, to really show you what this nighttime breathable mask does. It is been known now, it's becoming known as facelift in a bottle. I don't know about you, but having a little saran wrap on my face is a lot better than shooting it up with collagen and Botox, okay? And I'm just at that space where I want to have confidence. And I know a lot of people do, and it's good for acne and rosacea and everything else. So it's not just to get rid of wrinkles, which it does great. But I'm working on an email that has all the before and after pictures as well as the... Um, the pay plan and why I chose Lisa Monet because why I listen to Lisa Monet of lisamonet.com because she has her street cred man you know and she's chosen this as a they call it shrink wrap in a bottle or how to shrink wrap your face face <laughs> that sounds real I really didn't want this to be turning into a sales thing but that's just part of my life um this, in fact, is to do a documentation, everybody. I'm C.C. Cummins, and I am an independent distributor for Purium. I just became one, and this is my first, this is my before picture. I'm on day two, because I started yesterday on the Purium, and I stayed on it. Um, maybe that's too kind of see back there. So, a little bit heavier, definitely, but I love myself now. It's a difference. I never loved myself. And like one of my coaches told me, and I'd be glad to tell you who this is. I just don't mean to be name-dropping, but her name's Lori. And um, 
she told me, you know, and I was floored when she said this. I was like, what? That's, that doesn't make no sense. But she said, you know, Cece, I'm not going to get upset over if I'm thin. I'm not going to get happy over if I'm thin. I'm not going to get overly, like, excited about if I'm thin. And she said, Cece, you know, if I too much, and, and if I feel like I'm getting heavier, I put on a little weight, she goes, you know, I'm not going to be upset about that or sad. And I'm not going to be excited or the way thrilled. She's just like, hmm. And I, I didn't, I didn't understand that until I had actually been too heavy for like two years. <laughs> and I went, oh, oh, that's my, I see. You just have to deal with it. <laughs> so anyway, this is for the four. And then um, I'm not going to do every day because that's ridiculous. But. Um, I got, and my mom just came in with the driveway, but that's what I'm about to eat. These are flex foods that you can take with these master aminos. You take five of these. And uh, so I'm going to continue to have the next one, and we'll, we'll, keep, we'll keep going here. Okay. See you later. Love ya.